Now here is a pretty important question. The concept uh, which you learn here will be applied in many other questions regarding bond length and bond order. Bond order. We need to compare the bond length of carbon uh, and oxygen in carbon monoxide, CO3 to minus and CO2. So first let us take the case of CO3 to minus. While drawing the structure of CO3 to minus we get the structure is like this. Now we know that this molecule resonates therefore on drawing is resonating structure we get again you can draw resonating structure to get now these three are the three resonating structures possible for this molecule now we know the formula for bond order is equal to total number of carbon oxygen bonds in the resonating structures in the resonating structures upon total number of resonating structures now we see that let us check this carbon and this oxygen the total number of bonds is 2 plus 1 plus 1 equal to 4 upon the total number of resonating structures is 3 therefore this comes out to be equal to 1.33 therefore we know the bond order of carbon oxygen bond in co3 to minus to be equal to 4 upon 3 now let us check the case of co2 now carbon dioxide molecule is like this it has no resonating structures therefore the bond order is 2 upon 1 is equal to 2 for co2 we know the bond order to be equal to 2 this is bond order now for checking the case of carbon monoxide we again know that this carbon monoxide molecule has no other resonating structures due to which the bond order uh, is the total number of carbon oxygen bonds 3 upon the total number of resonating structures that is 1 therefore the bond order for carbon oxygen bond and carbon monoxide comes out to be equal to 3 therefore we can arrange bond order co greater than co2 is greater than co3 to minus now we know that greater the bond order lesser is the bond length that is if the bond order is 3 that is a triple bond is shorter than a double bond and a double bond is shorter than a single bond therefore in bond order of carbon monoxide being the greatest therefore the bond length order will be completely reverse of this that is co less than co2 less than co3 to minus so we get the final answer for the uh, bond length comparison of co co2 and co3 to minus to be the bond length of carbon monoxide is less, less than that of carbon dioxide which is again less than that of co3 to minus so this is our final answer so whenever you need to compare the bond length you can also compare the bond orders to get the answer.